hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to get the selected drop down select option value using JavaScript I'm selecting rugby if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates I'm using Notepad++ for this video tutorial. Now in this new one page, I'm adding a simple HTML code. HTML, I'm closing the HTML tag, header tag, I'm closing the header tags, body, I'm closing the body tag. Now inside this body, I'm sent tag. H1 how to get the selected drop down select option value H2 using JavaScript horizontal line now after the horizontal line, I am adding a form tag, I am closing the form tag, inside this form tag I am adding the select option element, select, I am closing the select tag, I am adding name property to the select, ddl select, option I'm closing the option tag the option label I'm adding select games game option I'm closing the option tag let's copy this one first one is on football value is equals to football the second option is cricket value is equals to cricket rugby value is equals to rugby tennis value is equals to tennis after form tag I'm adding label control I'm closing the label tag ID is equals to label message that's it we have just finished the designing part before writing the javascript functionality to get the selected drop down value into this label let's check the basic output on the browser save the file i'm saving this file on my desktop select option value dot htm save let's check the output here we got the output of that code which contains right now the head attacks and select option drop down which contains the games football cricket rugby and tennis my next step is whatever the game i select from this select option suppose for example i select cricket i want to get this cricket value into this label so for that I am using JavaScript in the header section I am adding script tag I am closing the script tag now before writing the JavaScript code first let me add this form name is equals to form ID let's write the code function get DDL
document dot get element by id get element by id method i'm adding the label id copy this one and paste here put in this in a single quotes dot inner html is equals to the selector drop down value is plus i'm adding the form id dot dd select which is a select name between square brackets let's copy this one again dot selected index dot text let's add some styles here put in the bold style is equals to is equals to color dot red In a single quotes. Press between single quotes. I'm closing the bold tag. Now the main important we need to add this function name in the select element on change event is equals to. I'm adding this function name between double quotes. That's it. Let's save this file. We'll check the final results on the browser. I'm reloading the browser. I'm selecting rugby. And here the selected value we got rugby. Oops, here something went wrong. The color we have desired is column. It's not dot. Let's save this file. Let's reload the page. Rugby, football, tennis. That's it.